So here we have got a question in which 97 into 98 into 99 into 100 plus 1 is given inside a square root and we have to find its value. So obviously there is a trick to solve these type of questions. We assume that y is equal to 97, right? If I take it like this, y square plus 3y to be equal to x, we can assume for some time. You see over here. Now what is square root of x plus 1 the whole square? Don't forget that it is positive only because the numbers over here are positive. So this is nothing but 9700 plus 1. So the answer is 9701. So here we have got a question in which 97 into 98 into 99 into 100 plus 1 is given inside a square root and we have to find its value. So obviously if you start multiplying these numbers and then you will find this uh, square root over here. It's a very tedious task, right? So obviously there is a trick to solve these type of questions. So suppose over here, we assume that y is equal to 97, right? If I take it like this, the thing inside the square root can be written like this. Square root of y into y plus 1 into y plus 2 into y plus 3 plus 1 over here. You see over here, if you take 97 to be y, 98, 99 and 100 will be y plus 1, y plus 2 and y plus 3 over here. Now you see over here, if I take the first term and the last term and I multiply them over here, what will I get? I'll get y square plus 3y. And if I multiply the second and the third terms, what will I get over here guys? It will give us y square plus 3y plus 2 over here. I hope up till here it is clear. And you see obviously plus 1 is there inside the square root. Now again, can we do a substitution? Can I take y square plus 3y to be equal to x for some time? y square plus 3y to be equal to x, we can assume for some time. You see over here. So this will be converted to square root of x into x plus 2 plus 1 over here. Now what is this guys? If you further simplify, it will be square root of x square plus 2x plus 1 and if you further use identity over here this can be written as square root of x plus 1 the whole square right now what is square root of x plus 1 the whole square don't forget that it is positive only because the numbers over here are positive so we are not talking about modulus it will be equal to x plus 1 only i hope this is clear so you see over here in place of x can we put y square plus 3y guys? So I can put y square plus 3y. Now you see y was what guys? 97. So if I start putting 97, it will again waste our time. So we can further simplify this. I can take y as common. So y plus 3 will be left plus 1 over here. Now you see y was 97 for us. So let's put y is equal to 97. Then 97 plus 3 over here will come plus 1. Now what is this over here guys? 97 and 97 plus 3 is 100. So this is nothing but 9700 plus 1. So the answer is 9701. I hope this is clear. So you see this type of question we can do easily if we do some type of substitutions. I hope this is clear to every student watching this video.